Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. We have all the action for you live on EA TV. Hello, great to have you with us. Welcome to the distinctive Al Bayt Stadium with its tent-like structure. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you match commentary. And alongside me is Stuart Robson. And really looking forward to bringing you this World Cup Round of 16 match. It's Australia against England. Absolutely, this should be a good game. I think both sides deserve to be here. But whichever team plays to their full potential should make it into the quarterfinals. It's going to be a good game. And the starting 11 for Australia. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. The England first 11. Jordan Pickford is the keeper. John Stones plays alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. Raheem Sterling plays with Phil Foden out wide. And the centrepiece of the attack today is Harry Kane. And so the match is underway. Calvin Phillips. Danger averted. Aydin Hrustic, Jamie McLaren. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Kane. Oh, nice ball over the top to Chase. And he drills it in. Corner coming up. They favoured a short one here. And the defender got the last touch. That'll be a corner. Going short. Kane. And taken cleanly by the goalkeeper. Hrustic McLaren Aydin Hrustic showing a real will to win the ball Kane and a foul in the opinion of the referee now what can they do from this free kick situation
Well, that's not how they rehearsed it on the training ground. Yeah, and I'm not sure what was going through his mind there. That was a poor decision to shoot from that distance. Well, four years ago in Moscow, I remember watching England take on Colombia, wondering if England were going to end the penalty shootout jinx, which they did. But, Stuart, is it going to be another round of 16 nail-biter this time? Well, that game against Colombia, they should have won in the first half. They were totally dominant. And then they let the opposition back in. And that's been one of Southgate's problems. When he has been in control of matches, things have changed and he hasn't reacted quickly enough. I think they should win this game. I think they should get through to the last eight. But it's not going to be easy. Jackson Irvin. Pressing high to win the ball. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. They need to get bodies back. Shot attempted. Well, it was straight at the keeper, but technically good goalkeeping. Sterling. And racing away here. Gives it a go. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. Who's going to get on the end of it? Still not clear. Foden. Here's Kane. Harry Kane! A goal! On the back of sustained pressure. Now they deservedly hold the advantage. Well, here it is again, and the clearance just isn't good enough. Giving up possession in a dangerous area, just poor defending all round. moving once more how important will that opening goal prove to be might be able to get in behind the defense a disappointing end to the move mount sterling has it the inside route looking promising well, closed down straight away Oh, that's a really good run. Mount. A gift for any goalkeeper. Kane. Foden. Oh, good save. Who can they pick out? Well, not cleared away completely. Rice. Always going to be the goalkeeper's ball. Stones. And Kane comes into the moon. Good looking attack, this. Can he finish this? They've gone and scored again. They're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back.
Well, as the replay shows us, Kane picks out the perfect pass to beat that defensive line, and the finish is clinical. It just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? So the ball rolling again at 2-0. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Oh, what an opportunity. Well denied by the keeper, but really he only has himself to blame. Well, no surprise there. England have enjoyed most of the possession and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield areas. And I expect more of the same as the game goes on. Yes, really going so well for them. And who knows, they might be able to craft another opportunity. Jamie McLaren Sainsbury has it Fran Karacic it's Jamie McLaren defensive Brazilians to shut them down well, totaling up all the stoppages we'll have two additional minutes and intercepted there. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. So back underway here into the second half. Space on the flank. Spot on with that tackle. Kane. Kane. Possibilities inside the box. Foden. Sterling. Ball is loose. Right over for now, it seems. Perfect tackle. And the emphasis is on creativity. But they took care of the situation defensively. Certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. Oh, no stopping him. Really vital interception. Kane. Well, he really wants his brace. Well, he looks so bright today. His movement has been excellent. Corner given. <laughs> they take it short. Now, well, still an issue here. Mount. Rice with it. Terrific block. Can he find the net? Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. And a 
short corner, let's see. Veering in field, Raheem Sterling. Pretty simple for the keeper. He has teammates around him. Oh, in with a chance! And a goal! That's his brace! They just can't keep him quiet! Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And in the 1v1, Kane makes no mistake. He never really looked like missing, did he? What a goal that is. And so the action continues with England very much bossing this game. And winning it back. Foden. Rice. And space for him to cut in. A gift for any goalkeeper. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. But the danger averted for now. Chilwell. Declan Rice. And plenty of room in the wide area. Well, he just couldn't make it happen. Stones. Walker now. Bellingham, now Harry Kane, Jude Bellingham, excellent vision, and the cross not quite imaginative enough, well, pressing really high, giving the ball away, Kane, a smart stop here, Aydin Hrustic. Wasted possession again. Mount. Now Harry Kane. Now, who can he play it to? He's in here. Oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? And time for the change now. Elects to go short. Another corner conceded. What can they do with this one? And taken short. It's Sterling cutting in. Tremendous block. Bellingham. Phil Foden now. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping.
and played short. Marvellous anticipation. Aydin Hrustic. Well, he's got past his man. Simple catch, really. So three minutes of stoppage time it'll be. Mount. And he stopped them in their tracks. Abraham. And now the end of the contest. England have made it through to the last eight. Well, the result was never in doubt, was it? They controlled the game from start to finish. They created numerous chances and they dictated the tempo. A very comfortable win for them in the end. As usual, Harry Kane, difficult to defend against. What did you make of what he actually did out there on the pitch? Well, I have to say that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.